Each year, ticks bite millions of Americans, and these pesky critters can make you and your children sick. Melanie Lawson tells us some of the best ways to keep them away. They're small, blood-sucking bugs, and you don't want them to bite you. A tick can spread serious diseases, like Lyme disease, Rocky Mountain spotted fever, tularemia, and others. It's very important for people to protect themselves against getting tick bites. To do that, avoid tick-infested areas like grassy or wooded spots. Walk in the center of trails. Wear long pants, sleeves, and a hat. It's a good idea to tuck your pants into your socks. Also, use a chemical insect repellent that contains DEET, permethrin, or picaridin. Make sure pets are treated with tick prevention medicine, and don't let them sleep in the bed with you. Also, check yourself daily for ticks. The sooner you remove one, the better. Lyme disease is not transmitted unless the tick is attached for at least 36 hours. To remove a tick, use pointed tweezers to grab it as close as possible to your skin. Without squeezing, pull the tick straight out, keeping it intact. If the head remains, leave it. Seal the tick in a plastic zip-top bag, rub the bite with alcohol, and wash your hands. But remember, if you can avoid getting exposed to a tick in the first place, that is the best thing you can do for yourself. There are many different kinds of ticks that are found in different regions of the country. Some common ones include the deer tick, the dog tick, and the Lone Star tick. Consumer Reports tried out some of the top repellents, and they have found a step-by-step -step guide for pet protection that we have posted on our website, newsforjax.com. Melanie Lawson, Channel 4, The Local Station.